this is the first video on this channel I welcome everyone and I'm gonna start with the calipers painting After six years of my car exploitation, the brake calipers became a little bit rusty. The main objective is to try to remove away all the rust. Of course you're gonna get better results if you remove the caliper from the base and use the sand blast. My method is the easiest and it is absolutely not that bad, considering that the most part of the caliper is hidden under the wheel. First step is done. Here is a closer look of how the author phosphoric acid works. Now I'm gonna try to apply two layers of autophosphoric acid on my polished but still rusty detail. The next step is degreasing. And now I would like to discuss one thing. According to instruction to the autophosphoric acid, you need to wait 20 minutes after applying acid. The surface turns into a primer and you can proceed with your painting job. I know that one of the products of the chemical reaction is water, but 30 minutes later, it was a pretty hot day. The surface was greasy. And this is the main reason why I decided to degrease everything. Now I'm gonna use the epoxy primer. The best thing that humanity has invented to slow down the corrosion process. Unfortunately, this type of primer won't neutralize the rust. And finally, my favorite step, painting. I recommend you to use the thermal resistant primer and paint in this case, because your calipers always get hot when you use your brakes. Some painters told me that there's no need in primer in this case. You should just apply paint on your calipers. But once again, what's gonna happen to your paint if the surface was rusty? Unfortunately, I didn't manage to find thermal resistant paint with the colors that I wanted to use in this project. That's why I had to use the acrylic paint. And you know what? It works. Two weeks later, there were no signs of any defect on painted surface.
I've decided to paint this part of brake disc too, because I found a little pieces of rust on its surface. Now I'm just going to use the base coat, the lac if you don't mind. Now let's move on to a second caliber. The color that I expected to see was lime, but suddenly it was closer to light green. Well, I've decided to give it a try. And after applying a base coat, it became deep green. It was a disaster. That's why the next day I decided to send everything. And of course the sun disappeared, it was a rainy day. And that's why I had to work into a not perfect conditions. Finally, I've managed to pick up a perfect color. The next step was to apply just a little piece of green gradient. And in the end I've added the base coat. Now let's clean up the wheels. Before we start I will remove the rest of the rust. The rest of the rust has been left here from the brake disc. I know that aluminum is not exposed to corrosion, of course if you want to apply strong oxidizer on its surface.
gonna use the Thai dressing. And that's the liquid wax. And finally, the job is done. Thanks for watching.